With tensions on the Korean Peninsula possibly showing signs of a thaw, U.S. President Donald Trump says he's open to holding talks with North Korean leader Kim Jong un himself, a remark most unlike what we've usually heard from the U.S. president. Now, President Trump also took credit for the talks scheduled this week between Seoul and Pyongyang. Our Devin Whiting reports. U.S. President Donald Trump says he would absolutely be willing to talk to North Korean leader Kim Jong un on the phone. Speaking to reporters at the Camp David presidential retreat, Trump said that he always believes in talking and that it's no problem at all. However, the U.S. leader made clear this does not mean talks come without preconditions, saying that he's firm on his stance and the North Korean leader knows it. He knows I'm not messing around. I'm not messing around. Not even a little bit. Not even one percent. He understands that. At the same time, if we can come up with a very peaceful and very good solution, we're working on it with Rex, we're working on it with a lot of people. It's a stark change from his usual tone. Washington and Pyongyang have been engaged in a war of words, with Trump taunting Kim Jong un as rocket man for his missile and nuclear provocations. Most recently, Trump boasted that his nuclear arsenal is not only more powerful, but actually works, in response to the North Korean leader's New Year's address, in which he claimed he has weapons capable of hitting the U.S. mainland and that a nuclear button is on his desk. However, Trump's apparently friendly gesture comes as South Korea and North Korea are set to hold official talks for the first time in more than two years. Pyongyang agreed to the talks just hours after Seoul and Washington delayed their military exercise. The U.S. leader took credit for the latest breakthrough, saying that if it weren't for him, the two Koreas wouldn't be talking right now. Right now they're talking Olympics. It's a start. It's a big start. If I weren't involved, they wouldn't be talking about Olympics right now. They'd be doing no talking or they would be much more serious. The U.S. leader added that he wants to see the talks take Seoul and Pyongyang beyond the Olympics, and that if something can come out of those talks, it would be great for all of humanity. Trump went on to say that at an appropriate time, the U.S. will also get involved. Devin Whiting, Arirang News.